How to start Shopify dropshipping in Pakistan, Shopify dropshipping Pakistan tutorial. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how we're going to be doing our Shopify dropshipping in the easiest way and we're going to be doing it in a place where not a lot of dropshipping is provided and that is Pakistan. So to start things off, what you're going to want to do is you're going to come over to shopify.com and once you're over here you're going to create an account for yourself now the account creation process is really simple uh it's simply going to ask you some emails and stuff so you're going to go into start free trial once you come to start free trial it's going to ask you you know let's get started which one of these best describes you you could just be starting or you could already be selling online or in person so go with whatever fits your you know repertoire so I'm going to go with, I'm just starting because obviously we're going to be starting our job shipping. So go with that. Then, you know, where would you like to sell online store? Obviously that would make more sense. What do you plan to sell first? Obviously we're going to be selling job shipping products. So I'm going to go with that, do that. And we're going to click on next. Now, once you click on next and come over here, you're going to choose where your business will be located. Obviously choose Pakistan as your business location because that's the main place where we're going to sell from and we need to tell them that our shipping address needs to be Pakistan. So once you do that, you're going to head straight into your account. Now, I already have an account, so I'm simply going to go into that. But yeah, just walk yourself through the settings that I showed you, add in the email and uh, it should be a piece of cake from there. So yeah, once uh, once you walk yourself through all of that, you're going to come to this dashboard page, okay? And on this dashboard page, uh, there's a few things that you're going to want to do. So first of all, you're going to add a dropshipping provider for yourself. And before adding that, you're going to go into your settings and you're going to set up shipping and delivery for Pakistan. So we're going to open shipping and delivery over here. And once you open shipping and delivery, uh, firstly, you're going to go to your general shipping rates. Okay. And once we come here, obviously, for first, you're going to change your domestic rates, then you're going to change your international rates. So obviously I'm going to add some domestic rates. Uh, you can either set up your own rates or use a carrier app. Now I'm going to call this the standard rates and let's say, you know, shipping inside Pakistan. I'm just going to keep the shipping cost at 350. That's still a lot, but you know, let's keep that at a general cost right now. And then there's international shipping, you know, international shipping from Pakistan to, um, you know, somewhere outside or somewhere outside to Pakistan. Now, they've kept a general price for that, which is this much PKR, which is a good general output price. So I'm just going to keep it at that and save it. So please do make sure to get a uh, delivery and uh, shipping charges. So once you do that, you're going to come on add apps. And once you go in add apps, you're going to click on Shopify App Store. And once you click on shop by app store, what's going to happen from there is you're going to be redirected to the proper app marketplace for Shopify. Now, once you're over here, what you're going to do is you're going to click on search and you're going to go with any drop shipping provider. So in my opinion, the best drop shipping provider would either be CJ drop shipping or Deezers. So I would definitely recommend one of these two because both of these work amazingly. In my opinion, the best for Pakistani dropshipping is Deezers because Deezers is directly affiliated with AliExpress and AliExpress delivers in Pakistan. So we're simply going to click on install for Deezers. And once you click on Deezers and click on install, it's going to take you through the whole process of installing it into your Shopify store. So just walk yourself through all of that. And once it installs, it obviously connects itself with your um, actual AliExpress providers or handlers. So make sure you have an account on AliExpress as well, because if you don't, then it's going to ask you to make one so you can connect it to your Deezers. And while you walk yourself into your Deezers account, it's also going to ask you to create an account um, for yourself on uh, your Deezers. So that is exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and create an account. And uh, once you go ahead and create an account on Deezers, as I said, it's going to ask you to connect yourself straight all the way to your AliExpress. So you can see it takes you to the application pricing as well. Uh, you can go with the free plan in the starting because the free plan works in incredibly well when it comes to Deezers. And here you can see it says link yourself to suppliers, which is AliExpress in this case. 
So simply click on link to AliExpress. And once you do that, we're just simply going to wait for this to load up. And uh, here's the login to AliExpress page. So you're simply going to go ahead and log in with your recurring AliExpress account. So I'm just going to do that real quick and be right back. So once you log in with an account you want to connect your uh, Deezers to, with, it's going to simply click, uh, give you the authorize option. So I'm simply going to click on authorize. And once you click on authorize, it's going to load my Deezers up. Now, once my Deezers is loading up, it's going to start giving me all these products that are directly affiliated with your AliExpress. And not only affiliated, they're actually products off of AliExpress. So to find them, you can simply go into find suppliers, okay? And once you go into find suppliers, you can see currently the Black Friday sale is going on as well. So you can actually take all products from there. And uh, then there's all of different kinds of things over here that you can, um, you know, take a whole inspiration and why from so obviously go ahead and drop ship products that are good in like uh, have a good niche and are obviously more you could say famous nowadays so obviously it's winters and you know people are want to stay cozy you know so i'm gonna go ahead with sweaters you know because a lot of people right now are looking around for sweaters they want to wear sweaters and all so look at this you start getting sweaters so what you're going to do is you're going to simply go over a product that you want to drop ship and you're going to go on this icon over here that says add to import list. So you're going to do that. Where it says imported. So once the product is imported, you're going to go over to import list over here. You're going to choose this product and you're simply going to click on push to store. So what this does is it's going to push this product to your Shopify store. And as you can see, it starts loading in. So what you're simply going to do from there is you're going to wait for this product to load in and there you go so it's successfully pushed a product and you can actually see this product in your product section over here let me just wait for this to load and there you go so it actually adds the whole product with the description of the product its specifications its media its images its variants you know everything that it comes with so yeah that is basically how you're going to start doing shopify dropshipping in pakistan so if you enjoyed watching this video please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel and if you want to see more videos like this where i give you tips and tricks on how to do drop shipping in different places then please let me know down in the comments below and i'll be telling you more about these but yeah, that's the general idea of how we're going to work with all of this. So I hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you. And uh, if you need any more videos like this, please do tell me. I am always available and I will give you the easiest step-to-step -step guides for any type of videos that you demand. And uh, if you have any queries regarding this video, you can let me know down in the comments. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Before signing off, please like and subscribe to the channel and uh, leave down a nice comment if you watch the video and please don't forget to share this video with uh, any of your friends in need or your family and uh, i hope you all have a great day so until next time i'll see you later and goodbye